Hi guys, welcome to my new video. I am Marco Motta from Planted Tanks Ideas. Today I wanted to, to, to make a short update about my, my shrimp tank, my yellow neocaridina shrimp tank. So during the last week I, I, am, I had uh, some deaths, some, uh, some baby, baby shrimp deaths. And I don't know why, I, 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 I didn't change anything, but I think that reason I had deaths was because I was using some leaves that now I, I removed that were um, oak leaves and maybe they had some uh, products in there, in them, because I had, I had deaths starting when I put the leaves. And now that I removed the leaves, I haven't seen no, de uh, no death anymore. So I think that the leaves are the reason. So uh, I just wanted to make a video telling you to be aware about the leaves you choose. Uh, choose the leaves that you are sure that weren't in comp contact with human intervention, interve interve with human intervention, so that uh, no one had. Um, had opportunity to put par uh, pestic pesticides or something like that and yeah that's um, a thing I wanted to tell you and to, to make sure that you were aware of. Other than that I added this uh, small baby handler fish this is beca because I, um, I wanted to see um, if a little fish could help uh, to, redu to reduce the excess excess amount of food and also because if there was a parasite or something in here like planaria or or something like that that I am not seeing these little fish can eat it and so remove the the problem if it's a parasite or something other than that you can see my my two yellow um, females that are very big and now are eating something and then Besides them, you can see all the old babies that are growing a lot. Some are are, are pretty clear, and clear one are, are clear ones are the males, while the the yellower ones are the females. This is because this isn't this isn't a really well fixed gene, so they will keep um, getting. Um, um, in time, in breedings, they will get to the wild form, so brownish or uh, transparent and transparent one. So um, I will have to do some selective breeding when they grow up and when they um, multiply some more. Other than that, um, I added a small almond leaf here that now is is floating, but tomorrow or uh, or tomorrow or next day they uh, it will sink and in a week it will be ready for shrimp to, to start eating it and also plant planter berries um, that, that is Ramsar's nail also likes to, to eat uh, almond leaves uh, and uh, yeah other than that I hope you will have a great weekend and um, yeah like subscribe and comment if you like the video uh, put a dislike if you didn't like the video and um, comment what should I make to, to improve the video quality and what they say and what they don't say, what they show and yeah. Okay, bye. See you next time.